peace be to you as we remember today the blessed virgin mary who was a great disciple of christ jesus who showed us today how one has to be a disciple in today's gospel jesus teaches us how to love our enemy it was the old testament thinking loving the neighbor and hating the enemy the neighbor for a israelite is a fellow israelite all those are non israelite are their enemies so this was the thinking they had and uh, in their commentary also the saints of god we love the sons of light and they will hate the sons of darkness so jesus seeing hearing all these ideas he gave a different perspective in one's relationship love your enemy pray for the persecutors it's a different and wise technique that one can win over his own enemy and this technique was well used by the early christians to shame their own persecutors the martyrs stood very strongly before the persecutors which brought them to the persecutors a bad image an uncontrollable situation in their government loving the enemies praying for the persecutors and this technique was great success for all the christians in the early times to overcome all kinds of enemies whether from the side of the government or from the society they were able to overcome everyone when you start loving your own neighbor who in turn starts to love you it is only your own love get increased but when a person loves his own enemy the god's love in him increases and this is the beautiful lesson the lord has given to us but actually loving the enemy praying for the persecutor is a very hardest thing for a human being because every human being has a tendency to respond in a violent way if he faces a kind of violence so it is the nature of human being god calls us to the godliness of human being to the state of godliness to the state of people of light for this one has to undergo a cross this is a martyr's life a christian life 
praying for the enemies praying for the persecutors is really a cross of life but we will have a day a resurrection dawn which will give us a great peace heavenly father we thank and praise you for all the gifts you have showered upon us thank you lord for this beautiful day thank you lord for being with us strength and heal us lord many a time we are unable to forgive our own friends the trespasses that we have with our brothers and sisters lord give your continuous grace lord so that by forgiving our own brothers and sisters we may also learn to forgive our own enemies and the persecutors lord give us the heroic faith of the martyrs so that we may stand straight even in front of our enemies we ask this through christ our lord amen